with another pickups video. It's just a quick one because it's, it's obviously not garage sale season here. But uh, I did manage to find some pretty good bundles through uh, Facebook groups and uh, on online. So uh, I'll show you some of the things I've got in the past few weeks. I got a Wii bundle and uh, came with this black Wii here, came in the box. Um, the kid who I bought it off of, they said that they've had more than one Wii, so I guess one broke. And you just threw everything in here from all of the Wiis. So I'll show you what it all came with. Came with the holder here. Uh, came with the component cable. It's an aftermarket one, but still works. Uh, sensor bar. One, two, three nunchucks. A white one, or two white ones and a black one. Classic controller. I got two power bars here in the Nintendo brand AV cable. The actual Wii, it's missing the um, top cover for the uh, classic controllers for the GameCube ones, but that's not a big deal. Still works. And a bunch of remotes here. There's uh, four white ones and one black one. Now, uh, the reason I bought the bundle is because it came with a whack of games, so I'll show you the Wii games first here. Uh, go through them one by one. We got Mario Kart Wii, Mario Strikers Charged, Zelda Twilight Princess, WarioWare Smooth Moves, Donkey Kong Country Returns, Super Smash Brothers Brawl, uh, Big Brain Academy, The Wii Degree, Metroid Prime 3, Mario Galaxy, Okami, Rock Band 2, Wii Sports, and they put it in this weird case, but a uh, homemade case, I don't know about that. And then uh, Super Mario Brothers Wii. So some pretty decent titles, but the main reason I bought this package is because it came with this stuff right here. It came with a whole whack of GameCube games too, and some decent ones. There's uh, Smash Brothers. Zelda Wind Waker, Luigi's Mansion, Mario Kart Double Dash, and this Double Dash has the uh, bonus disc in it, although it's not the bonus disc case, it doesn't have the spot for both discs, and it doesn't say on the front, usually it's cut off here and says with bonus disc, but I think that's an awesome little surprise to find the bonus disc in there too. Uh, Pikmin 2. Paper Mario, Pikmin 1, um, Harry Potter and the Quidditch World Cup, Metroid Prime, Namco Museum, Geist, Sonic Heroes, and uh, XGRA, I think, I don't know how to pronounce that, <laughs> Extreme G Racing Association, it's like uh, futuristic motorcycle racing. So I got this entire package for 150 bucks, which I think is well worth it. Most of these games, if you know your games, you can easily justify it just in the games alone. Uh, it also had some, a few other Wii games, but they're mainly kids games. Um, weird ones, like I remember there was Shrek the Third and some other ones that aren't very popular. I just sold them to a guy at my work for cheap uh, for his son, and he was happy about that. So for 150 bucks minus the what I, I think I sold them four games for like 10 bucks, just cheap. So 140 bucks or 135 bucks, I think is what I paid for this entire package, which I think is fantastic. Also, um, one of my local stores, uh, the Game Exchange in Kitchener, moved locations, so they've got a bigger and better location almost right across the street from their old one and at their grand opening they had some awesome uh, Nintendo games for sale and I managed to find one I didn't have for cheap uh, I got Street Cop for 10 bucks it's a power pad game 
So that will go into my uh, set over here, add to the collection. And yeah, so that's pretty much all my pickups as of late. It's not garage sale season and I work six days a week, so pickups are few and far between. But when I saw this online, I had to go and scoop it up. And uh, yeah, um, that's it for my pickups video. Um, as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, more videos are coming, so uh, until next video, I'll see you guys later.